Meta's profitability fell in the fourth quarter, worrying investors who pushed the company's shares down by more than 20% in after-hours trading on Wednesday. Meta, the parent company of Facebook, Instagram and WhatsApp, recorded $10.3 billion in net income during the latest quarter or $3.67 per share, a 5% decline from a year ago. The company had been expected to post $3.84 per share. Its revenue figure did beat projections, though. Meta's sales reached $33.7 billion, more than the $33.4 billion forecasted. As the name change reflects, the company is trying to shift from its mobile and desktop social networks toward a concept called the Metaverse, a digital realm accessible through augmented and virtual reality. It is a drastic pivot for the business toward a still largely unproven concept, but one CEO Mark Zuckerberg sees as crucial to securing new young audiences who have abandoned Facebook. Case in point, Facebook registered no increase in monthly users during the fourth quarter, a rare slip in growth. The number stayed at 2.91 billion. Meta's existing apps have been weighed down further by last year's whistleblower scandal that further criticism about the company's handling of misinformation and problematic content. But for the foreseeable future, Meta will continue to rely on its core advertising business. Ads accounted for the vast majority of its fourth quarter revenue, some $32.6 billion. The new financial filings made public Wednesday represent the first time that Meta has detailed the performance and costs around its Metaverse project. That unit, which Meta calls Reality Labs, had $877 million in sales during the fourth quarter but lost $3.3 billion and almost 60% greater less than in the year prior. Reality Labs revenue largely comes from sales of its VR headsets. For all of 2021, Reality Labs lost $10.1 billion, a 50% increase. Our path ahead is still not perfectly defined, Zuckerberg said on a call with analysts Wednesday evening. But I'm pleased with the momentum and progress we've made so far. These numbers make it obvious that building a metaverse is an expensive endeavor, and Meta has fierce competition. Snap has also said it is pursuing a similar plan, as has Microsoft, which last month announced it would buy video game maker Activision Blizzard for almost $70 billion as part of its metaverse goals.